All right, what's up guys? Welcome back. So today we're back in the garage and I'm going to make a really quick video for you guys today and I'll try not to talk too much. So I put myself in the bottom corner just for some extra dramatic effect because it, yeah, maybe, maybe it looks more special. But, uh, so I want to show you guys how to find HP tuners logs if you did not save the log. So sometimes this happens, you like click a button and you lose the log. Sometimes you wanted to save it and you didn't save it or you sometimes, and I've done this in the past where I'm like laying in bed for three hours and I think of something and I'm like, crap, I wonder what that log looked like. And then I realized that I can actually go back and look at the stuff. Some of you may know this already. Some of you may not really even care about this, but if you do care about it, that's why I'm making the video. So I want to show you how to go back and find the logs because HP Tuners logs and saves every scan that you make. So if you're looking at the, the screen, you go into your little my computer deal, whatever computer you have. So it's going to be in the documents for the computer. You go to HP Tuners. And it's not in Logs and Tunes. Logs and Tunes is what you save. Your logs that you save, your tunes that you save. If you go into VCM Scanner, and then you go into uh, Logs. So this is where it's going to save all your like math parameters and your layouts and your graphs and gauges and all the other stuff in there. So it, it automatically saves every log, every scan that you make. So if you click into Logs, here you can see everything that I've done on this computer since I've gotten it. So, and this will save a 30 second scan, a 30 minute scan, it, it saves everything. So I'll show you guys, uh, I'll go to this little guy right here, this five kilobyte one. So this is just going to be like a little 30 second scan, uh, just to show you guys that it saves everything. So this was just one that I started and then stopped immediately and didn't keep for any reason, didn't save it, 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 it saves it. So I'll close that one and then I'll go down to this this big little guy down here and show you guys uh, a longer scan. So this is one that I actually uh, was watching for a long time while I was driving, but I didn't save it because it didn't really have what I felt like any uh, useful information. So uh, I guess useful is kind of subjective, but uh, I, I did end up using this. I, I went back and looked at it, but I have a lot more comfort knowing now that I don't have to be so urgent about saving the log file when I'm done with it. If it, you know, if I've done it a lot, I've done it a lot where I'm like at the track, I forget to save it. There's a lot going on or I'm driving around doing some testing and I just forget about it. Or I, I don't think it's relevant. And then I want to go back and look at it later just because I think of something else that I'm like, okay, I want to compare what was happening between this time and this time. Uh, it saves everything. That's how you find it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and it helps you. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.